Welcome to Solutions Studio. This is a free series on C programming language. If you like these videos, please subscribe to follow along with this series. Also, please like and leave a comment and share the video to help spread this series. Hello and welcome to this episode and in this episode we want to discuss uh, the use of the hashtag flag when we are uh, printing integer numbers and also when we are printing uh, double numbers and what effects uh, does this flag has when we are using it in printf statements. Now let's go and see the example in here. Here I have declared and initialized an integer value an integer variable of C, it has uh, this value and also we have a double variable P and it has uh, the same value but in floating points. Now let's go and run this program and now as you can see here in the results you can see that uh, when we are trying to print uh, this integer number using uh, the O, which stands for the octal representation of the integer number, we will get uh, the octal equivalent of that number. And then when we use hashtag along the octal specifier, you can see that we get a leading zero or a prefix of zero. Now in here you can see that we have used uh, the conversion specifier of X and also the capital conversion specifier of X which both of them will convert uh, the integer into hexadecimal representation. You can see that here we have got uh, the hexadecimal representation of this number and then when we are using the hashtag flag we get uh, this leading and a zero prefix uh, that shows us that this is a hexadecimal number which could be very important when we are trying to show that a number is hexadecimal. And in here also the number you can see that is in hexadecimal and because we have used the capital letter X, printf will use the capital letter X to print uh, this statement. And then also for the floating point values you can see that when we are printing uh, the floating point value using the G conversion specifier and without uh, the hashtag we get uh, the printed result in an integer notation but when we're using the hashtag and this decimal notation will be forced on this number to show that uh, this number is decimal. And that's it for this episode. I hope this has been informative for you and I would like to see you in the coming episodes. Stay tuned.